Nausea, who's a, an Ermac loyalist, and we've got Shaz, who's a Bo Raicho main, but he's going to be playing Jackie because she's cheap. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. And he's, uh, he's, in my opinion, obviously I've not played every single Jackie, but he's one of the best we have in Europe. He's very, very good. Nausea is one of the best fact, Ermacs though. in Europe. Go on. Interesting fact, his, uh, his PSN name is Shaz the Best. However, I've heard that he is the worst Shaz. That's true. He probably is. Shaz the worst. Shaz <laughs> is free. It's plenty of different. I mean, he's setting himself up for the fall there with that PSN name, if you ask yeah. me. Yeah, yeah, I agree. It looks like oh, a five year old made it. Like, yeah, I'm the best. <laughs> anyway, Shaz is a really good friend. He's a super cool guy. Always looking to help out, help out the community. You know, if you've got any questions, things like that, he's always there. He's a great player. So, it's just starting off here with some sort of pressure. Goes into the mid. Oh, right off the bat, he is not afraid to throw those out. Yeah, he's just he's just showing early that he's not afraid to disrespect Shaz's pressure. Goes for the overheads, great blocks from Shaz, jumps wow, out. Okay. Shaz now, already showing. Do you know if Jackie has an option to punish the mix-ups into float that Ermac has? Ermac has this variation. I don't Can't believe... Can she punish them? I don't... I think she can get... If there's like a gap in between, she can stand in one because it's six frames. But if he does it quite tight, I don't think he'll get a punish, but I think he gets a jump out, and that's what he was looking for there. I don't think she actually does have a solid, like, punish again. Like, I think her armor whiffs the back forward too. Yes. So, maybe Gauntlet Strike though, the, the back forward four. But you'd, I'd have to ask Shaz, maybe we can ask after the set, but I'm fairly sure it's tricky. And again, look, no, she's only that's, one game up. This is exactly what he wants, the mix. Great blocks from Shaz, look, she's trying to get the jump out there. It's not working if out. I'm not mistaken, that air blast oh, is also finish. still plus on rock. Plus ten, I believe. <laughs> exactly. So this is a real character. Yeah, this we is uh, this. this is rough. What do you do against the floating away? And yeah, that was pretty much guaranteed right there. I think if I'm going to be honest with this matchup, there's going to be a lot of mix. Now Shaz hasn't been getting hit by the mix, but he's not been able to enforce his own game plan. True. He's not. He needs to get. Um, he needs to get Nausea in the corner himself and use Jackie's 50-50s. And it's, it's just like a game of momentum, but Nausea was... Every moment he had of, like, a bit where either Shaz was slightly negative or even plus, he was just armoring out and saying, no, I need to get my mm. game going. Let's see if Shaz can adapt. He's not that's, really... That's the thing in this matchup, too, I think, because Jackie really wants to control the pace for, for the most part with her gunshots and the uh, up rocket. However, the thing with this variation of Ermac specifically is that he can just float and float away. So even if he goes into float state and he tries to anti-air with the up rocket, he can just uh, float he, back he, and then punish can, that yeah. attempt. Yeah, he can float in the exact area. Like there, there it is now. Can you see that little area yep. where he's floating in? Jackie can't contest. Can't reach him. It doesn't mean that Jackie doesn't have a chance because Jackie's got very good run speed. See, look, he could have punished that interactable there, but he's, he's too busy trying to just like throw out He's trying to do predictive gunshots and rockets when he needs to do reactive. Wow. Brilliant block What punish. was that? So Jackie gets good damage, gets the hard knockdown, but again, he's just going to jump out. Shaz could have just ran up and meted him there. Giving him a little bit too much respect. Uh, yeah, that seems like Close that's the been uh, the trend. Nausea gets I to do whatever the hell he wants, and uh, people are having a hard time keeping up with that. Just afraid of his armor. Yeah, you know, advancing armor like that. It's very strong. Oh wow. Can't but this is where this is where Shaz wants him and he armors out immediately. He knows. Yes, that's it. No, no full conversion. Goes to the low rocket, that's minus one. Nice standing one anti no conversion. And armor again. Shaz needs this to This is just exactly put so much pressure. where Naja wants to be. See this? Oh. Nice, nice. So he can't he can't catch him as he's floating downwards. <gasps> nice standing one anti but the stanky leg isn't the right conversion. Standing four into the gauntlet charge. He's gonna get okay. Nice, goes for the floor. He wants to break the armor. This that's a good option to break Thank armor. You. Plus, no, do not contest stanky leg. Nice stanky leg as a meaty wake up. And mm -hmm. baits the delayed and finishes it. So this is a round to Shaz now. So Nausea just jumps out the corner intractable. No sort of um, anti-air from Shaz though. Blocks the overhead, blocks the shenanigans. No interrupt in the delay. Oh, so he does okay. one. So back forward two is an option. And this is where Shaz shines. Stanky leg gets clashed. Back forward two to keep him there. And this is why Shaz is one of the best Jackies we have on our scene. Oh, he, he just does a wake up grab. Ride. Yeah, he didn't need to ride. <laughs> But that's okay, Shaz is still in a commanding lead. Great knowledge from Nausea there to just armor through the gap between the rocket and the, and the wow. shots. 
he actually went for a four straight after the block this, down so one. This is tricky. This is nah, he, yeah, he needed to Pretty armor good. out with the interactable there. I'd have loved to have seen just arm and interactable out in any of those gaps. That's it. Wow. Yeah, controlling the space with the down threes and then finishes him with his sort of like safe string that he's got in the neutral. Very nice for him, though, yeah. 2 0 up. So this was a lot better, though, and that's mostly, I think, because Shaz just got to play more of his game. Exactly. He, he realized, he's hang on a second. He's to figure out the neutral a bit more, too, I feel, I feel like. Yeah, he was like, hang on a second. Like, I mean, I'm sure he's not played a Spectral of this caliber ever. Like, yeah, you might have played a Spectral. It's not Nausea. Like, he's he's, he's, he's he's played this character. He knows this character in and out. This is. I mean, I think Shaz would actually... I mean, people would think it's weird. He'd probably do better off. He'd probably do better right now against Master of Souls or Mystic, just because he's got more experience yeah. with their tendencies. Spectral's a whole different. Spectral outfit. is a completely different character. You can yeah. kind of Mystic and Master of Souls, basically the same character with one big difference being safe armor and Mystic. This, however, completely different. If you do not know what's going on with this character. You are not going to have a good time. But doesn't get the conversion, but gets the soft pressure on knockdown. And yeah, look at that, oh, just floats overhead. on over. Yeah, wow. great option. Down two. Down two. So now Shazzy's realizing that he's going to have to close the space before he does any kind of projectile. That was pretty decent for Nausea, but he was a bar. And again, <laughs> look not at the disrespect. Afraid. He does not want to play neutral with his character, and I don't blame him. Jack Jackie's very scary. Jackie is extremely scary. And Back he forward is... two doesn't work. Shaz is just trying to find buttons that work, and there's, there's yeah. the normal and special. Yep, that's the thing. When you're expecting, you know, the, things to come from the air, you're not expecting that uh, that interactable hit you like that. Round two. That was, uh, that was smart. I think Shaz might be clocking on, though, that while he's flying, he can't really do much. I mean, it gives Shaz the opinion to push him towards the corner. He yes. just, he does still have to be careful. Oh, nice conversion there. Changes his combo because he realizes he gets the corner juggle. What's the mix going to be? Nice. He just, he's just pressure, just What's pressure. Nausea just thinks he's going to stagger, but he just continues the string. Nice. Keeps him in there. Goes for the forward three. Doesn't miss. And there's some pressure. respect from Nausea. Nice. Put, puts him back in the corner. This is where he wants him. Goes to break the armor. Goes for the overhead or the mid. And this is Shazza's round. Nice. And Shaz still has all and still his he chased him all over the map, or all over the stage so far, and Nausea not able to get the full nice out of the Shaz covers the back dash with the full auto. I think the difference there was Nausea just didn't have the bar to disrespect wow. like that. How many hits from did that? Did I was about to say, yeah, did he just that go three, like right? Shots? Yeah, that that's like crazy. It. That's crazy. I thought that would armor break, but uh, maybe not. Maybe it's just, oh, nice sweep there. <laughs> Shaz is just blocking high. He knows. If yep. you don't know, guys, he cannot convert from his low in this matchup as Spectral. Maybe in the corner, but mid screen, I, I think he has to go for the overhead. So yep. Shaz, oh, with the matchup knowledge, I'll just take all the lows. But Nausea's like, okay, then we'll lows still do damage. This is tricky exactly. for Shaz. What can he do? <laughs> no, oh, just, he, 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 he was, was fishing. He was fishing yeah, for the brutality. <laughs> and Shaz knew too. And this is Frio. What does he do? He can't. He can't get him out the air. Hey, and then when on the spot. ground, his Jackie's pokes just don't seem to like match his. Like she has some terrible pokes, and yeah. he's just like down one, down. Oh, sorry, down three, down three, and he's out of there. He needs to find something and find something fast. He can. I don't think a uh, variation switch will change anything. To be honest, I think this variation easily does uh, does best against Spectral. Okay. Yeah. Because uh, he can just completely run away from both the other characters, and they have nothing to contest that with. Yeah, I'm trying to feel like, I mean, even even this variation, the up rocket and the gunshot seem... He's getting, what, 4% if he manages to land a gunshot full screen, but then it's just reset the neutral. True, I but it does make him think more about floating away. And that's that's the thing. true, You can yeah. limit that, that's, that's a big deal. But again, Jack, uh, Shaz has a really good high tech, and I'm just wondering that if he can just get the pressure on Nausea, Nausea will not, he will not be ready is... for the level of high tech that Shaz has. He won't realize what's plus, what jails, and it's surprising what does and what doesn't. Oh yeah. But he's going with full auto though. He's obviously, he's just trusting his best character. Nausea here with a full convert. Goes into hard knockdown. Look at it, he's just keeping it full screen. Look, I'm happy up here. I'm just gonna float away. Dive pound, safe. Safe pressure this, this is just, just completely safe for Spectral. Shaz is doing back Only forward too. One. Oh, oh, if he could have uh, got a conversion. Yeah. That, yeah, that's pretty much it. 
If he got the conversion there though in the corner, that, that was one mix in death. Oh like, yeah. One mix from Jackie and it's over. Round two. I see what the uh, Nausea does to get out the corner. The interactable used. Shaz jumps over. Fishes for the down four. Nice block on the overhead. And there's the yeah, EX. Uh, EX Hadouken there in the corner to keep Shaz down. Goes to the hard oh, knockdown. Wow. That was still a punish, I think. That was an option select on Jackie's wake up. Down three to low profile and then punish. This is just great stuff from Nausea. <gasps> oh, he's not Alright, here comes the damage though. Oh, chooses to switch uh, positions. Setup? Yeah. So this is a little oh, bit of okay. a side setup, but he should have just gone for the overhead there. He's a bit too yeah. to grab. He's too far behind to go for the grab, and yeah, it's a bit of a shame for him. I believe that's 4 0 to Nausea, and this is that the first is. seven, and this is this is Please. rough for Shaz. He's, he's going to have to go back to the drawing board here. I, I, I just don't even know really where to. Uh what he should be doing differently to, to make this work for him. See, the, the, the thing that uh, Jackie wants to do is she wants to get you in that corner and then mix you. If she can't keep you at a, at a reasonable distance and annoy you with the gunshots and the low rock and that kind of stuff, she wants to get you in the corner and then mix you. The issue, though, is that not only does uh, Spectral Ermac have the charge, which is a uh, uh, has apparently three hits of armor and goes almost full screen, he also has a safe wake up in the Soul Blast. So it is very hard to actually keep him in that corner because he has a ton of options to get out. This is this is just my sense because obviously I mean I don't play Jackie at Shaz's level, he knows best. But from my perspective, again, when I'm looking at this matchup, Shotgun doesn't need the corner. She can do a lot of her stuff, a lot of her vortex mid-screen with a bar. It, al it doesn't allow Nausea to sort of get out of the pressure because she can like just go straight to overhead and low. Oh, he misses that. that Confirm into a punish, that's too bad. But uh, anyway, he's, he's in the lead here now. Nice, nah, back forward two there. Basically back forward two. Oh, standing one wow. into Stanky. Where do you see this? <laughs> Where do you see this kind of stuff? Like, ah, oh, it's so good. And he can get a full combo from that as well. That's why he does it. That's his muscle memory. Standing one into Stanky leg, into run up. And there it is again. You nice. will see some of the most optimal stuff coming out of Shaz. And this is the best, this is the best game we've had so far. Nice. Stanky leg to cover the delayed wake up, then straight into the overhead when the Wow, down two! <laughs> oh. on deck. Yeah, full left death. That is that it's yeah, close to death. Just... Oh wow, no, it is, that is death. <laughs> <laughs> we've got a 15% damage special after scaling. Yes, we are Jackie. Yes. <laughs> so, Shaz, I don't know if he made an adaption there or he just said screw it. I'm going in. He he just got him where he wanted him, and I think you know the the, uh, the fact that she has such amazing damage off of basically every single conversion is big too, right? Because she only needs to hit you two times plus some chip. That's all she needs. And he got yeah. those hits. He got him in the corner. Nausea was not able to get out those two those uh, last couple times. Yeah, and he paid for it. So and forward. I think it's forward two up two with Jackie. I'm not too sure if that's the exact input, but she basically does like a shuriken motion twice yeah. and it goes up into the air. Yeah, it's a that string it. is so good for stopping people from jumping out. Oh, oh wow, what a that read. <laughs> oh, amazing. Now Shaz is feeling a little, he's okay. feeling himself okay. right now. Mediating and no conversion there. Sadly. You can't jump out of that string. Like, even though that was just part of his combo, that just goes to show that string is so good at knocking out airborne opponents. Oh, he goes for sort of like a little shimmy with the back two, but he doesn't pull um, off. He barely misses. <laughs> no, she just doesn't want Oh, that hit mark, the yeah, so high. That's nice. That's the thing, Nausea does not want to deal with any of this crap until he has him in the corner. Yeah. I'd, I'd, I'd really like to see from Shaz some armor that... Wow. Yeah, back wow. forward two is such okay, an option. 16% there. Cost him a bar, but he had the bar. Go straight through. What's Broke the oh, arm. run up, stanky leg. Can't jump. Like, he shuts out all his options. Just can't jump, can't do anything. The stanky leg will hit you. And oh, no, she has some tricky staggers. Oh, down four from Jackie. Into the gunshots, yeah. Ooh, that's okay. okay, that's not too bad of a trade for Shaz. Right, yes, he gets the conversion. Man. Look at this damage. Look at that. Needless. And Nausea again, just he's just doing it now. He's afraid. Like no. Wow. Oh, okay. there it is. He, that is what he was looking for. Oh, that was so unfortunate. Ah, you know, the, the last Ooh, interesting okay, stuff. So I think he's 
Naja is now at the point where he is going to throw out everything. He wants to do all he can to not have to deal with Shaz's stuff. And there's right the teleport. Not see, you see, we haven't seen the teleport option for a while, and then yeah. he just pulls it out when he needs it. Really smart from Naja. He's, but I think I honestly feel like Shaz has got Naja on the ropes here. He's really scared. He, yeah, that's you not can real. Tell. Yeah, you can not jump out there. Away. Shaz has stopped him from jumping out. His conversions haven't been the best, but at least wow. he's got something. Beautiful jump one, and again. I think that was a stanky leg that he messed up. Yeah, that's just one of the things about playing such a high execution character in tournament where there's so much pressure there. And yeah, he's just going to do staggers. But Shaz, that's interesting. Again, see how Nose is just armoring out of all the pressure, whereas Shaz is holding onto his meter through the pressure instead of just yeah. disrespecting. Jackie yeah. does have safe armor. Oh, nice. He safe armor and he's building so much of that meter by doing all these lift uh, yeah. uh, floats and uh, stuff. Oh man, good tech. Oh my yeah. god. Yeah. And it's the difference. I really feel like this is the difference in the matchup. Nausea's, that's unsafe. That thing, like, he, if Shaz blocks that, he's eating up to 40% damage from Jackie. But he's I using it in such an unpredictable way. Yeah. Where you're like, there's no way. He wouldn't just, he wouldn't just throw that out. Or you're not even thinking about some of these. I tech to throw. Great, okay. Key. I'm gonna go in and try to do something. Nope, he already armored. And it's so fast. I think it, it's 5-1 now to Nausea, but I honestly feel like Shaz has slowly sort of brought back how close these games are. Yeah. It's real close. If it had been like this from the start, we'd probably be looking at 2-2, two, 3-2. Two, two. But mm. Nausea's just really had the upper hand in the matchup, but let's just see what Shaz can do. He's obviously made the adaptions that he needs. He needs to shut down this EX dive pressure. It's yeah. it's a full combo punish. He needs to bait it. He needs to, he needs to be just his game plan. Beautiful stanky leg into a down free check. Gets the conversion. Goes for the safe conversion. I do believe he can get a little bit more there. No, stanky leg meaty on the wake up. That was Nausea Good jumping pressure. out. Gets the conversion. Wow. Okay. Nice. Now he's playing a reactive game. Doesn't have to just throw out random stuff in the hopes that it hits. And also, Naja has no meter right now, so there is no no fear of him using anything. He can just go in and use his pressure. And this is the oppressive full auto that, that we, we normally see, yep. where she can shut down every option you have at most ranges when you're in the corner because the stanky... Oh, there Here it is. Here we go. It's just, yep. He feels that he's on the ropes. And he's just stopping, uh, stopping his pressure at those points where Nausea probably is like, okay, this needs to stop. There right it now. is, yeah. Just any any time Nausea is minus, he's just throwing out the charge, and that's because Shaz has led him. Wow, that was a quick game. And this that is 5-2 nice. now, and we might have a set on our hands. Nausea has to really think about this to think, okay, <laughs> he might that have was a bit of a blow up. This this might have been a a, a down road complete. Yes. There is a new key. This, uh, Having said that, though, they are very mix heavy characters. One guess wrong from either party, and it can look like that. He has true, got but I his feel that Shaz hasn't been getting mixed that much. It's mostly just been those armor moves at the exact right times that uh, let Nausea get in and just you know do his thing, and not even yeah. not even so much the mix because I don't feel like Nausea has been able to mix Shaz as he has uh, other people in the last couple of days that we've seen him play. He's been so disciplined, Shaz, to block high. Nausea's yep. probably Round so used one. to people blocking low. <laughs> and, you know, he shut that down, but he hasn't been able to quite get a grasp of the neutral. And now Shaz has. Look oh. at this. What a completely different game. Beautiful. Oh. With, with punish with a stanky leg. Doesn't get the conversion. Armors the pot. Yes. Okay. And look at that. Oh. What an option there off that. That's such a strong option select for oh, Jackie there. Up. No big deal, though. He's got hugely. He doesn't need to. Doesn't need to rush things now. Beautiful blocks on the pressure. Ooh. Yeah, back that she's out, but just gets clipped. Nothing too major. Uh, but this is bad. Okay. Yeah. Beautiful high this block. This is where it gets painful. Okay, nice. so that is awesome. And good. now it's painful for Ermac. Plus, you cannot do anything. With your He's plus. You have to respect. Yeah. Nice. Perfect meeting. Enjoy yourself so far. That is a very hard move to meet you. Oh, he does it. He's been to him now, Shaz. Thank you, like, second nature. Beautiful jump kick from Nausea. If he'd have gone for jump punch, he probably would have lost out, but the jump kick just so fast. One of the best jump kicks in the game, man. Wow. <gasps> did he? Yeah, he, he did. That? He did it what's called a micro duck, and he just ducked the start up of the string and then goes straight. It's like, it's not even a reaction. It's just, I'm going to do it. 
He yeah. ducks the first move, then goes straight into his six frame high, and he's full combo punish on a lot of strings that have slow secondary follow ups. Ooh, nice oh, backdash from Nausea, that was beautiful. And this is Nausea's game. I, I, I really struggle to see how Shadow. Okay, disrespect, no armor you yeah, Oh, no! Oh. That could have been the game. That could have been it. Yeah, he only needs one combo into one combo. Fight. That's all he needs. Uh, that's all he needs. Like, one knockdown, good read on knockdown, over. That's Jacket. And yeah, this is where we're seeing the picks come in. He's finally duck, he's finally cracking now. Nausea's sort of slowly conditioned Shaz to block low. Nice, nice down, down one. one. Yeah. Good breaker from Shaz. He needs he, he needs a combo, he needs it now. Oh, uh, he's gonna make it rough though. He has two more bars to work with. See? Oh yep. And this is this is very rough. This is gonna be extremely hard to knock it. It's just one more. Just use one more. There we go. That's it. It it's difficult, and, that, and that's 6-2, I believe. It's difficult because Shaz has to unblock to move forward, and Nor's is just happy to float back. And every time he unblocks to move forward, you cannot react to that charge. No. no so he has to put himself in a vulnerable position just to close ground. Not, not to put a normal or a special into the mix, just to just close to the gap. Yep. And it normally looks not arms. a big deal, but when you're that low on life, that Jackie's used to characters problem. coming to her. She's used to being. That's why Shazzy's so good at doing reactive stankiers to jump ins and things like that. He is used to the character having to go towards her. Spectral doesn't. He doesn't need to. He's like, I can just chill. I'm chilling over here. Oh, I'll do a couple of you know the ground bounces. Then minus one. What are you gonna do from full screen? That was all. Wow. Oh, that was that very was tricky. <laughs> That was a weed-inspired mix-up right there. Oh, yeah. And Shaz oh, is getting mixed he's, now. He's not spinning yeah. the meter. He will here, though, probably. Oh, still not spinning the bar. And again, I don't think it's, you know, as, as talked about enough. Oh. That wasn't ready for the no. meter on the teleport. Spectral's mix is a restart. It's yeah. not just, you know, oh, I've mixed, I'm a combo, I've been knocked down, that's it. It's... Oh my god, he's hit me. I'm going to have to have an armor out of this follow-up, which he can bait. Mm -hmm. Or I'm going to get mixed again. Yep. It's crazy. Fight. He Tiffany. is probably one of the scariest characters to be in the corner against. Yeah. Because it can seem like there is no legitimate way out. Because everything... Seems and he guess. finally baits it. Gets the full combo yeah. conversion. Needs right, to make this count now. Two bars, almost. Two bars that you can use on. Oh, that's too bad. On armor here. So Shaz needs to be aware of that. He's not afraid to throw those out. But again, he's sat on two bars, Nausea. He knows he's sat on two bars, and he's just going to go, oh, well, every single time you give me a gap, I'm going to do something with armor on it. You've got to respect it, lock it, bait it. Yep. Oh, and that look at this. Box this is, is so ridiculous. Armor? No armor. All right. No armor now. Oh, that's just, is that it? Oh no! Yeah, what the hell, Mary? That's too bad. He still, if he would have been a little bit more patient, and then I think he still could have brought it back. What was that? But I yeah, think, I think patience is that matchup, and I feel like it's a matchup you have to. He's probably gonna have to play a lot more and realize I'm not taking too much damage here from from Ermac. I'm just gonna let him float himself to the corner and like why he can do like let's say let's say. Shaz can't move forward. That means that Shaz can move forward, press standing one, or like with a stand kit, and then block in time before he gets hit by the next thing. And he's not taking much damage from the chip from the head pounds. Is it a match where he just has to work him to the corner and then trap mm -hmm. him in? But again, that well played to both players.